Hey guys, this is Anthony Morganti. I am MrPhotographer.com. Today I'm going to start something new. I'm calling it Two Minute Lightroom Tips. In it, I may give you a very basic tip on using Lightroom, something more advanced, or something in the middle. The idea is I do the video in two minutes or less. Today we're going to talk about black and white mix. You probably know that if you're in the basic tab of Lightroom and you want to change an image into black and white, click where it says black and white and you have a black and white image. When you do that, the HSL tab turns into the black and white tab and we could then take the sliders and change the corresponding colors, luminance values. For example, where that red bar was, I could move it and make it brighter or darker by moving the red slider. Blue, I could move it right or left to make it lighter or darker and it will change blue or any color that has blue mixed in it. Now, in the real world, you would take a color image such as this, switch it to black and white, and then you could affect the various tones in the image to give it more tonal depth. For instance, if I move the red slider, I'll make the red bricks of those buildings lighter or darker. Orange, I'll move the orange bricks lighter or darker. And let's say you're not sure of what a color is. You could use the targeted adjustment tool. Just click on it to activate it. Go over the color you want to change. Click with the left mouse button and drag down to make it darker, up to make it lighter. And you can see when I'm doing that on the sky, I'm moving the blue slider a lot and the purple slider a little. So it's affecting both those tones. So that is the black and white mix in Lightroom. Thank you everyone who watches my videos. I really do appreciate it. I'll talk to you guys soon.